Well, it's a warm but rainy day and uh, it's just our group here now. It's a new Everybody else is gone. Pretty much everybody's just hanging out in the rig today. <laughs> That's all right. All right, friends. So we left the campsite, obviously, and our convoy just got a little bit bigger. Now Katie's following us. Um, we're going to go to another free campsite. Just left Walmart. I switched from Verizon back to Straight Talk. Because I wanted to, since I have on, uh, truly unlimited data on my Wi-Fi hotspot, I wanted to um, get a uh, lower cost plan because I had the $99 plan with Verizon, which is truly unlimited on, on that on my phone as well. Um, I wanted to get like a $35 plan just for talk and text and I'll use all my data um, on the Wi-Fi. Well, I tried to do that. Oh, I got to put this camera down a little bit. I tried to do that, and I selected the $35 plan with Verizon. Well, there's an access fee of 20 bucks and all this other stuff, which I think is ridiculous. It comes to $55 for a $35 plan. It's absolutely ridiculous. And then I used... Uh, the two gigabytes it provides immediately and they automatically charge my account an extra 15 bucks instead of asking me if I want more data I accidentally had my Wi-Fi off on my phone or it just jumped off by itself well instead of asking me they just charged my account so you know that's that's makes it 70 bucks for three gigabytes absolutely ridiculous um, Oh, green light, 65, 70 bucks. Anyways, uh, now I, I just, east for 10 miles. I just went to Walmart and I got the SIM card because I just paid my phone off. It's a thousand dollar phone. So I just had the SIM card switched out and I moved to Verizon for 35 bucks and if I, get the auto refill it's $34 instead of 55 with Verizon so it's a much better deal I was with straight talk for many 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 years before I got the contract with Verizon well since my contracts up I'm trying to reduce my monthly costs as much as I possibly can at the moment so I gotta get in the right lane I hate it when people just drive on your side. Go. So that's what I did. Now we're heading uh, over to another free campsite. This one's on a river. And I can't wait to get there. Woo! I want to reduce my monthly costs as much as I possibly can. You know what I'm saying? friends <clears throat> we're driving to <clears throat> our new free campsite and uh we just stopped at the hong kong buffet and we ate enough for six families especially katie yeah. oh my gosh i don't know where she puts it it was so yummy <laughs> <laughs> just kidding <laughs> she kind of eats like a bird where's my dog okay anyways i saw this we're in between Fort Worth and Santa Rosa. It's like a, just a giant bay. Absolutely beautiful. 
We got the stairway to heaven right here. Sober, what's that? The sto the stairway to nowhere. <laughs> Look at the seagull. This is pretty cool. You know what I'm talking about? I'm digging it. So, we, I think we only got like 35 miles or something like that to go. You gotta make reservations for a lot of these campsites ahead of time, which is actually pretty easy. I should put a link in the description below of the website you go to. <clears throat> it's actually pretty, pretty fairly easy. It's just you quickly fill out your name and reserve a site, that's it. Oh my gosh, there's water running right here. Where the heck is it coming from? What the heck? That is strange. Peace out. Well, friends, I walked down a little ways and it looks like I may have found a dock that I can walk down, which would be pretty cool. Just take a look into the water. See how clear it is? So, but no. Come on. Come on. It's pretty clear. There's a tire in the water right there. I can dig it. Can all of you dig it? <laughs> Stupid question. <laughs> hey, it is what it is. But every once in a while, sometimes, it literally is what it isn't. friends welcome to the new campsite it's ridiculous it's right on dead river road and uh there's a whole bunch of campsites here actually and there was actually some people left some wood behind for us to burn they literally wrote mike katie and rick on the logs we couldn't believe it so we knew that they left them for us I mean, how can you be more specific than that? Heck, Katie's social security number was on one of them. Yep. Yep. So. <laughs> that trash can especially. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, Well, we're going to get set up here and, and then not get set up because we're set up. Oh. Oh, bye. Okay. <laughs> Hey guys, living on the road full time in my RV can bring me on some pretty crazy adventures. I encourage you to follow along in my adventures on the road, so please subscribe to my channel, share my videos, and thanks for watching.